The group America also recently entertained a military audience at Osan. Once again, Air Force Sergeant Rick McLaughlin. America made its debut return to the military home they grew up in as they entertain a packed Challenger NCO club with their smash hits from the past. The group began in the late 60s while stationed with their respective Air Force families in England. Since that time, they've had top hits and plenty of successes, but have never quite made it back to play for a military audience until now. We were raised on, uh, on bases. Our dads were both in the service, and uh, so we spent all of our educated years in, uh, growing up. It's a very familiar feeling for Dewey and I, and to actually be billeting on base, it's, uh, it's bringing back a lot of memories that were long kind of buried. Really, yeah, it's kind of a strange feeling coming back. It's really been 20 years since we were on yeah. base, yeah. formally moving within the, the guys and whatnot. So a lot came back, shuttle I, buses, my, ID cards. My feeling is that it's, I think it's what we have to offer. Obviously, we're very, very happy to be here, and, uh, and for us to have a first after 20 years in the business is a very rare thing. We tour the states, the mainland... Uh, every year and and often uh, different international places but we've never been to korea at all so the opportunity to come here in itself is unique for us and we're really pleased to be here since 1977 bunnell and backley have been on their own leading america through its ups and downs and surprisingly enough it wasn't until osan that a reunion of sorts took place when dave peak the younger brother of former founding member dan peak was called up on stage to help close out their final encore of the evening. You know, I've been an America fan, whether my brother was in it or not, all my life. And uh, I've seen him play when I was younger, when my brother was with him, and then after he left the group. And I've always, uh, whenever they're in the area, I've always, you know, tried to catch them and uh, catch their show. And I just happened to hook up with them. It's kind of a coincidence that they were uh, playing here in uh, Osan. And uh, I was able to, one way or the other, to get a hold of them. And they just invited me up for the encore. and. Probably ranks up there with one of the biggest thrills of my life. And how about older brother Dan? How would the former America singer and songwriter feel about little brother stepping into his old spot for a brief moment? I think he'd be real surprised, real surprised. Probably, uh, I don't know, maybe a little jealous even, I don't know.